What's up, every guy? Every guys. What's up, everybody? Coach Rolo here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to fix broken dumbbells. I've already done this for a lot of the dumbbells down here. I've done it even with 50-pound dumbbells. It works. It's been incredible. Also, I am not a handy guy. I can barely screw things into a wall, which means if I can fix dumbbells, so can you. Shout out to my buddy Steve who showed me how to do this. He's incredible. First off, guys, you don't need any tools. All you're gonna need is some original JV weld. Now, sometimes I've realized these are loose, but they don't come all the way off. So what I did is it felt a little bit loose, so I just dropped it a few more times on the floor so I can get it all the way loose. And then you should be able to unscrew the dumbbells. Now, I'm extremely anal. I hate when things don't match. So when you're putting these back on, just make sure that you're gonna line it up and you're gonna set it down nicely. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do that. All you literally need is, you don't even need a cup, I just have that so these don't spill, is something to mix this stuff with um, so that it can set. So typically what I did was I would be doing a few dumbbells at a time, so I would mix this in the cup together. Uh, but since I only have one dumbbell right now that is loose, I'm gonna actually just mix it inside here and mix it around to uh, activate it. That's what it's called. Again, I'm not super handy, so I have no idea. Now, the thing is, once this stuff dries, it is not coming out. So make sure you have a towel with you to be able to wipe up the sides and make everything look nice. So literally, you're gonna open both of these bad boys. All right, boom. And then what I like to do is I'll do the white one first so that I can see. I'm just gonna put enough so that it's gonna go all the way through up. I know that sound effect made you guys understand what I'm talking about. So you're just gonna try to make sure you're evenly uh, putting both of these in. So as much white and the black one, boom, that's about even. And then I'm gonna grab my mixer, it's just a plastic knife, and I'm gonna mix this until there's no more white or black, it should be gray. And I'm also gonna be getting it on the sides of the wall where the threading is, so that way it is never coming off again. Um, I have had no issues, guys, if I fixed them, they've already set, and I've been playing around with the dumbbells already. Now, the cool thing, in my opinion, is, one, you're not gonna have any of these falling on anybody's head, and if they start getting loose again, you just pull that bad boy off, puts in this JB weld, uh, but I haven't had any issues. None of them have gotten loose again. So, all right, I've mixed it pretty good, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. So literally, it's just all around. I tried to set it all around. And then I'm gonna take the extra that's on this knife and I'm gonna put it right here on the top and on the threading just a little bit. There's not a lot left, so that's awesome. All right, now simple. Make sure you put this so it's not touching any of your equipment. And you're gonna grab this and screw it back on. Sometimes they're so destroyed that you can't even thread them. You'll just literally set it on but this one is, so it's slightly uh, getting tight. And then again, I'm super anal when it comes to uh, matching this. So match your dumbbell up. What I like to do is I like to push on it on each hex so that it's even. And then I'm gonna come around. There's not a lot that came through, but there is a little bit. I'm gonna wipe it up. Boom. And what you guys are gonna do is make sure you don't let anybody touch this dumbbell. Um, for, I did 24 hours, it says six to eight, but just to be sure, and I'm also going to set it down exactly how I want it to set. So I'll literally set it on the ground like so, so that when it sets, it's even, because again, you want pretty dumbbells. You don't want them to be all weird and different. So I'm just gonna set that under there, and literally, that is it. You let that set, that bad boy's not moving anywhere. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want some more tips and tricks on how to upkeep things in the gym, let me know. Hit the like button if this provided you some value. Subscribe for more. And as always, there's only one thing between you and your goals, and that is work. So make sure you guys go put in work. I love you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Shoo.